At Flagstaff's paper-to-paper -paper plant, 5,000 tonnes of material is recycled every year. It's one of the group's six commercial enterprises where business is booming thanks to a dedicated workforce. 240 of the staff here have a disability and a career. Each employee has their own individual development plan and we work with them to meet their goals. Just 15% of the organisation's income is in the form of government funding. Flagstaff is aiming for total self-sufficiency. Its latest joint venture, coffee, roasting and packaging, will see it get closer to that mark. We see it as a major growth area in a, in, at a time when a lot of our businesses are shrinking, so we're trying to find new business, businesses and keep our people employed. A change in state government policy means public sector agencies can now contract disability organisations without the need to go to tender. The council has, I believe, a responsibility to support local industries and this is one area perhaps where we can uh, look at future, uh, uh, as I can say, uh, commercial uh, arrangements. Well I'm certainly going to go back to Shell Harbour um, and look at everything that we do and see um, where we can save a few dollars and look certainly Flagstaff would be a wonderful place for us to have our business. Michaela Gray, Win News.